Hi, my name is Steven Tippett. I'm recording this video outside of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. I'm a former World Teach volunteer in Ecuador for the year program, and my current position is as an IT professional in a study abroad organization at Arcadia University. My name is Alden Jones. My name is Laura Nixon. My name is Quincy Carroll. My name is Stephanie Globus Honick. My name is Brett McSpadden. My name is Kate Dana. I'm Nancy Fingerhood. I was a World Teach volunteer in China from 2008 until 2010. I was a year volunteer in Namibia in 2011, extended in 2012. Uh, I volunteered with World Teach for two years in Costa Rica. And I was a World Teach volunteer in Costa Rica in 1995. I volunteered for World Teach in 2005 in Ecuador as part of the year-long program. I served in the World Teach Colombia program in 2014. I was a World Teach volunteer from 1994 to 1995. I lived in Thailand. The picture I wanted to share with you today is this one. And the reason it's so important to me is that it represents the realization of expectations. This is my kinder, my kinder students on my second year, just their feet. And I love this photo. Um, this little guy has his shoes on the wrong feet. I remember an incredible trip riding on, on the top of this train. I took on a computer project to get internet for the school. Uh, I have photos of myself with my co-teachers and people that were in my school. This is the first time me and my fellow World Teach volunteers went to the jungle. One of the things that I wanted to share is not a photograph but some things that my students gave me through the year. Uh, most of my letters that I received of gratitude, happy birthday, teacher I love you, they're all in Spanish. I was a Peace Corps volunteer from 1999 to 2001 in Bulgaria. The only reason I got into the Peace Corps was because of my prior experience with World Teach. And that kind of just builds to, as a field director, we started this um, ICT conference. But this is an example of why you learn Spanish volunteering in Ecuador. When you have to learn the Spanish word for to derail because it just happened to you, you remember that word. And this is a gift from my students in Ecuador. It's a beautiful rainbow jacket that I still have. What sticks with me is that, you know, just kind of a con continual learning process. You take what you learn, you put it into use in the next project. I just love to be reminded of my time there and all the um, important relationships that I built and um, the incredible experiences that I've had. So thanks very much to World Teach for that, and I feel very grateful to have had that experience. Thank you, World Teach. Thanks, World Teach, for everything. <laughs>